Hello, and welcome to the Revival Remote Control tutorial. The goal of this video is to teach you the ins and outs of the Revival Remote to better understand how to use it and to get the most out of your massage chair. Let's start out by going over the button layout on the front face of the remote and what each of the buttons do. Begin by turning on the remote by pressing the power button at the very top of the remote. This button is used to turn the chair on and off when connected to power and when the power switch on the back of the chair is turned to the on position. Below and to the left of the display screen is the red demo button. Pressing the demo button will start a quick auto program that demonstrates all the available massage techniques that this chair offers. This is the perfect program when you have limited time. When a new user sits in and selects an auto or manual program, the massage chair will perform a body scan every time. This scanning technology ensures an accurate and personalized massage for every individual. To the right of the demo button is the recline and zero gravity button. Press once to place the chair in a reclined position. Press again to place the chair in a zero gravity position one. Press a third time to place the chair in zero gravity two. To return the chair to a reclined position, press the button a fourth time. The next button is heat. When pressed, this quickly turns the lumbar heat on or off. To the right of the heat button is the pause button. Pressing this button allows you to pause the massage at any time. To resume, simply press the pause button again to continue your massage. The next set of buttons are the auto program buttons. Pressing any of these buttons will start an auto program. There are eight different options to choose from. There is full body, revive, neck and back, waist, extend, just air, ease, and bedtime. Each of these auto programs provides a different massage that is designed to stimulate muscles and ease tension. I recommend trying each of them out and seeing which one is best for you. Below the auto program buttons is the manual massage. Press this button to toggle between any of the different manual massage techniques. The indicator light displays which massage technique you are on. One is kneading, two is tapping, three is kneading with tapping, four is shiatsu, and five is rolling. To the right of the manual massage is speed. Pressing this button allows you to adjust the speed of the mechanism. There are three different speed options, low, medium, or fast. Below the speed button is the width button. Press this button to adjust the massage roller width. You can choose from three width levels only when in tapping, shiatsu, or rolling techniques. Note, this button is not functional when kneading or kneading with tapping technique is in use. The next button is the back zone button. When pressed, this button allows you to adjust the massage roller zone. You can choose from four different zone options, full coverage, upper back, lower back, or target. If you select target, you can use the up down adjustment buttons to move the rollers to any desired position on your body along the L track. Up next is the foot roller button. When pressed, this button will turn the foot rollers on or off. The next two set of buttons is the foot rest and back rest adjustment buttons. When holding down the foot rest adjustment buttons, this allows you to raise or lower the foot rest. You can adjust the back rest just the same. This allows the chair's back rest to recline or bring the chair to an upright position. To the right is the up down adjustment buttons. Mentioned earlier, these buttons are used to adjust the position of the back massage rollers. They are used during initial body scan while the remote is beeping or while in targeted zone mode during a manual massage. The next two buttons is the air zone and air intensity buttons. Pressing the air zone button allows you to select between the different airbag regions. You can choose from foot and calf, arms, shoulders, calf and arms, arm and shoulders, full body, or if you want to turn all the airbags off, Press it one more time until all the air zones on the display screen are turned off. The air intensity button, when pressed, adjusts the air massage strength of the massage. You can choose between low, medium, or high intensity. And lastly is the five minute timer button. Press this button to increase the massage session time in five minute increments. Now that you understand the settings, layout, and functions of the Sharper Image Revival Remote Control, you can now fully enjoy your revival and truly maximize your massages. Enjoy your chair and congratulations on purchasing your very own 
Sharper Image Massage Chair.